Hi guys, it's me. I am here with another I am fun size video for you. A little itty bitty short one, but a really special one, I think. At least it's special to me because um, it's something that I have used many times in my own life and that some of you have asked about. Um, a lot of you have sent in questions about nervousness. Um, what do you do when you're feeling nervous, whether you are about to perform, you're about to go in for an audition as an actor, or really anything else in your life. And, um, and this was something that I actually sort of discovered a, 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 not a few years ago, so really pretty recently in my life. And that was this. I was nervous about something, and I was checking in, and I was checking in with how I felt physically. And I realized that how I feel physically when I'm nervous is very, very similar to how I feel when I'm excited. Which, you know, would be surprising in that moment because they feel in your head and your heart like completely two different things. But then I realized, no, actually being nervous and being excited for me are pretty much the same thing with one notable exception. When I'm nervous, I'm thinking about all the things that are going to go bad. And when I'm excited, I'm thinking about all the things that are going to go good. So, a simple fix, right? Why would we be thinking about all of the things that are going to go bad when they haven't happened yet? When we could be thinking about all the things that could potentially go good that haven't yet. I mean, both of them are relatively equally possible, right? I go in for an audition, it's equally possible that I will do well as, well, hopefully it's not equally possible that I will do well as that I will do terribly, but it was equally possible that something good will happen, right? So I started applying this to things in my life that were maybe things that I was less invested in to test out, to test out the theory. You know, if I was nervous to go meet someone that I had never met before, why was I feeling nervous? What did I think was going to go wrong? And instead think about all the things that could go right. This could become a new best friend. This could lead me to some other kind of adventure. And the more I put that in practice with things that I was perhaps less invested in, the easier it was to start feeling excited in times when I maybe would have felt nervous before. So think about that. See if that's something that you might be able to apply today in your life with something that maybe doesn't make you super nervous, but just makes you a little nervous and see if it works. I know it started working for me and it seemed like such a simple fix. I was a little mad at myself that I hadn't figured it out sooner. Um, but now I give it to you so that you can try it out and hopefully it will help you in your day today. Take care. Bye.